So donkeys can be pretty destructive, as you can see here in my little open shed. This is where I've been keeping my, uh, my wild donkeys, and uh, they're just about eat it to the ground. Um, we're going to be replacing this shelter here pretty quick anyway, so um, I thought it'd be a good, good opportunity to kind of talk about uh, what goes on with donkeys. If you're thinking about getting donkeys, or if you already have them, you got to know that they can do this. And, and the first thing that we need to do is understand why do they do this, okay? It's not cribbing. Um, you know, a lot of people use horse logic when they're thinking about donkeys and how to fix some of their problems, and it just doesn't always work, okay? So to understand a donkey, all right, they like to eat woody plants. They've actually got a, a bacteria in their lower gut that helps them process woody plants. And so they can actually eat uh, things in the wild and, and that and get nutrients out of them, whereas a lot of equines can't. We'll pass it right by. So they can eat lower quality foods and get nutrition out of it. Uh, so, so they have that tendency to eat wood. Right? So the other thing about a donkey is in the wild, they may travel 10 to 12 miles to 15 miles a day eating. Okay? So if you feed your donkey morning and afternoon, okay, if you figure they sleep about uh, two and a half, three hours a day, if you subtract the time they sleep and the time they eat, you've still got about, I don't know, 15 to 19 hours where they're standing around in a 24-hour period doing nothing, right? And, and that's not their instinct. So if they're standing around bored and they look down there and see this wood, all it takes is one donkey to, to, to start chewing the wood and the other ones say, hey, let's try that too. And the next thing you know, you don't have a barn left, okay? So that's one of the reasons donkeys chew. You know, I see a lot of folks on Facebook, hey, my donkey's chewing my barn, why is that happening? And, and they'll say, well, it's because they need nutrients. They need, they need, you need to give them some more salts and those kind of things. Um, and that may be true, okay? I, I mean, I'm not here to dispute that, that your donkey may not be getting enough nutrients or, or, or salt or minerals. Um, I give my donkeys, uh, well, there's really three kinds of salt blocks. I do the white blocks, I do the, the brown mineral blocks, and we do the yellow, like the sulfur blocks, I've tried those. Um, I usually have the, the brown and the white out blocks, and it seems like they like the white blocks better. Um, they'll, they'll eat both of them, but the white blocks are gone quicker. The least uh, they like is the yellow one. They don't care for the sulfur. Okay, so, you know, keep your loose minerals around. I'll give them loose minerals if you want to do that. Give them a bag. I, I usually give them some of that as well. Um, so I'll make sure they have that, um, uh, and, and, and they still chew, okay? <laughs> so. Um, so that's not all, that doesn't always work with the minerals, but you need to make sure that you keep minerals in there for them. It could help. Uh, but like I said before, uh, it's in their nature to chew wood, okay? So that's something to think about. So what are some other things we can do to keep them from chewing wood? One of the things that I do um, is I keep, I keep, uh, this is a piece of aspen here, and you can see the donkeys have been chewing on this pretty well. Um, and it does kind of help keep them from chewing the barn. Um, I put this in there after the fact, <laughs> they'd already started chewing it, um, but they kind of they kind of shifted to this, and I keep, I've got them right now on the 10 by 10s out there, and I, they, they've all got chunks of wood like this, and they're with them, and they'll chew the heck out of it. So uh, this is a good thing to do if you've got some, uh, you, you kind of make, make sure that the wood you're giving them is not toxic. Uh, aspen is a really good wood. It's a soft wood. It's a very fibrous wood. It's good for them to, to chew on, and they'll eat the bark off of it. This was dead dead aspen and they really like chewing on it so they'll they'll chew this down to nothing and I, I usually keep a big pile of aspen logs over there and, and, and swap them out quite a bit. You know there's a lot of remedies I've seen um, there's the um, there's the, uh, um, the the paint you can put on I've seen folks use uh, and, and I've heard mixed results about that uh, I've got friends that use it some folks said it worked and they stopped chewing their wood uh, other folks said they stopped it for a little while they started chewing it again I've heard uh, motor oil, I've heard uh, soap, I've heard uh, hot sauce, and I had one friend with a funny story about the hot sauce. He said, you put the hot sauce on there, and at first they wouldn't, they wouldn't chew it, and then next thing you know, they were like, hey, thanks for the hot sauce. They kind of spiced it up for us a little bit, so they kept chewing it. So all those things um, that don't seem to, to work, I mean, some with mixed results. Like I said, you may have, have tried some of this other stuff and worked, and, and uh, by all means, make a comment down below this video and let us know what works for you. Um, what I found the best thing is to build a metal barn, <laughs> okay? And then cover the wood on the inside with, with a, uh, a mesh. Um, I've used um, chicken wire before, and that, that kind of works. It's kind of light, they can pull that off. 
a heavier mesh might work. I have a friend of mine who, well, a couple friends of mine who use a chain link fence around the outside to keep them chewing it. So uh, you'll cover that wood any way you can. Uh, on my other corral down there in the barn, I've got uh, that metal drip edge over the top of, of two by fours where they can't get their mouth and chew it. So that seems to also help and keep them from doing it. But, you know, it's just something you've got to understand. If you've got a donkey, they're going to chew, okay? So, um, you know, make sure that they've got their minerals, make sure they've got uh, their loose minerals or salt blocks and that kind of thing, but then you got to make sure you're, you're keeping them from chewing, okay, beyond that. So either, either give them some logs to chew on like I've got here, cover, uh, cover the metal the best you can, or excuse me, cover the wood with metal the best you can to keep them from chewing, but, uh, but you just need to understand that donkeys will chew. It's in their nature. It's something they do in the wild. And if they're standing around for, you know, 10, 15 hours a day with nothing to do, they're going to chew. It's just something they do. Okay, so be mindful of that. And if you have any questions, by all means, shoot me an email. Uh, and uh, comment down below if you've got a, a remedy or something you found that works to keep your donkey or your mule from chewing. Okay? All right, thanks for watching.